Hello, and thank you for joining me today. I wanna take a moment to express our deepest gratitude to all of the EMS agencies that are out there. You have been on the front lines, tirelessly serving your communities, not just during the pandemic, but every day. We understand the immense challenges you face, from labor shortages to insufficient funding and reimbursement. And yet despite all of these obstacles, you have shown unwavering dedication to your mission of saving lives and improving patient care. As we continue to navigate this evolving landscape of EMS, Boundary remains committed to advocating for the needs of agencies like yours and supporting your critical work. We are honored to stand by your side as we continue our efforts to create a healthy and sustainable industry. We have been working tirelessly with government officials and partnering with local and national EMS associations to advocate on your behalf. In fact, this past year, we collaborated with both Congressman Kim of New Jersey and Congressman Kerry of Ohio to reintroduce the Supporting Our First Responders Act in the 118th Congress. This bill, if enacted, will provide much needed funding for items like employee recruitment and retention, supplies, and equipment. Three other bipartisan congressional representatives have provided their endorsement to the bill as well. And our next steps will be focused on getting sponsors for the Senate version of the bill and reaching out to members on the House Energy and Commerce Committee to build support. We are also collaborating with other industry leaders to advance emerging models of care. And we'd like to thank both the NAEMT and AAA for joining forces to advocate for both the extension of the treatment in place and transport to alternate destination waivers as part of the Public Health Emergency Bill. Wherever EMS needs an advocate, that's where you'll find Boundtree. And even though the global supply chain has begun to normalize, we continue to advocate for EMS to be prioritized for the distribution of life-saving medical supplies in the face of any disaster. We've been actively working with HIDA and federal officials from the Administration for Strategic Preparedness and Response to develop a partnership between both healthcare distributors and the government that will help to ramp inventory and quickly and effectively prioritize and expedite critical medical supplies for EMS during pandemics and other natural disasters. EMS agencies, however, still face ongoing drug shortages impacting your ability to effectively care for patients needing these life-saving drugs. And that's why Boundtree has actively been engaging both the FDA and NAEMSP on addressing these drug shortages on behalf of all of us here at Boundtree, I'd like to sincerely thank all the EMS agencies for your tireless efforts in saving lives and serving your communities. Boundtree is proud to be your partner, and together we will make a difference. Thank you.